Hi, I'm Dr. Judy Morgan of Dr. Judy Morgan's Naturally Healthy Pets. I've been a veterinarian in the holistic field for over 38 years. And today in my kitchen, I have friends that are from Viva Raw Pet Food Company. And we're going to talk about how to balance nutrients for complete diets for cats, which are very different from dogs. I'm Zach, co-founder of Viva Raw, a company that focuses on high quality nutrition for cats and dogs. We ship all over the United States. I'm Jennifer, the other co-founder of Viva. And so today with Judy, we're gonna take you through um, all five of our single protein recipes, chicken, turkey, beef, duck, and rabbit. And specifically, we're gonna look at our pure recipes, which are a base mix that follows the prey model raw ratio of 80% meat, 10% bone, and 10% organ. So with it being a base mix, there are some additional vitamins and minerals you'll need to add for your cats um, to customize it for their nutrition. All right, so we're going to start with our chicken recipe for cats. And this is the Viva Raw Pure Chicken. So this contains meat, bone, and organ? Yeah, so specifically um, chicken with brown bone, heart, gizzard, and liver. Um, heart and gizzard, by the way, are muscle meats. So that's going to be our base, and this is a two pound pack of the pure chicken. And then we're going to, and so you can go ahead and put that in, and then we're going to add the ingredients that we need to make this a balanced recipe for cats. So the chicken formula is definitely a more moist formula than definitely. the other ones. Yeah. So the moisture comes from kind of a mix of things. So um, chicken by nature is just like the muscle and stuff itself just has a higher moisture content. Um, and then, I mean, but that's like really good for cats because okay. cats get, do get a we lot of moisture. definitely want food. high moisture for kitty cats. Yeah, and then also it's, there's like a minor amount, like the way the farm processes it has to do with it too, but we don't obviously don't add any water to this, but you know, Perfect. it's a good high moisture food. Okay, so we have our uh, vitamin, mineral, amino acid analysis that these guys were nice enough to provide. And we, oh, we have a taste tester who <laughs> wants to show up early. Um, so this recipe doesn't require a whole lot of supplementation. We've got trace minerals that we need to cover, uh, copper, manganese, and iodine. And then we have a couple of vitamins that we need to cover, vitamin D, vitamin E, and thiamine, which is vitamin D1 or B1. So for our trace minerals, we're going to use kelp. And I chose Dr. Connor Brady's Irish kelp for pets. And with this, we need one gram. And his product is nice enough to come with a two gram scoop. So we're going to estimate a half a scoop and just sprinkle that in there. I'm going to use that Mix scoop. that in. Oh, so one thing is um, we are mixing everything for like a two pound batch because that's what our food comes in. But obviously, if you only have one or two cats, what you can do is you mix this and then you can portion it. Um, we like using ice cube trays or even like those super cube trays. Um, it's super convenient. You can just like do a batch at a time and you've got like food for a week. <laughs> So I happen to have oh look at that super cube trays. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the next ingredient that we need is wheatgrass, and this is actually for our copper and manganese. The kelp was for our iodine, and again, it wants one gram. So I'm going to use about a half a scoop of the wheatgrass. Yum yum. And the wheatgrass is also supplying our vitamin E and our uh, vitamin B1, the thiamine. So that, this is a great product because it covers a yeah. lot of bases. Wheatgrass is like a superfood. It sure. is, absolutely. Um, and then the other thing we need is to cover our vitamin D3. So we're going to use the RX vitamins for pets, RX D3, and we only need five drops. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And it's actually super important that you're looking for vitamin D3 instead of D2 because that means it's it's bioavailable um, from an animal source rather than just from um, a plant source. All right, let me get a small bowl and a cat. Where's my kid? A cat. <laughs> the cat. Well, yeah, where's the cat now that we're looking for one? Put something there. Sure. Just a little bit. Whatever. <laughs> How much does she want? Oh, she wants a whole blob. Come. <laughs> Sneak up on it. Look at that. <laughs> Is it good? 
She says, you're watching me eat. I don't know if, I can, <laughs> if I can take the pressure. <laughs> She's a real star of the show. All right, so that's how simple it is to balance the Viva Raw uh, cat food. And uh, I think using these as a portion, one of those would be actually really good for a kitty cat. And then you could freeze them or put them in the refrigerator. But if you froze them, when you pop out your cube, make sure to warm it up to room temperature when you feed your kitty. Yeah. And that didn't take long to disappear. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. I hope you are as excited about trying these recipes for your cats as my clouder was trying these recipes. For more information and for 20% off your first order at vivarawpets.com, use the code Dr. Judy and please like and follow them on social media at Viva Raw Pets. Yeah, and don't forget to like um, and follow Dr. Judy. Also on her social medias at Dr. Judy Morgan or go to her website, uh, drjudymorgan.com for tons of great information on how to keep your pets naturally healthy.